Where there's a will, there's a way. I ended up putting this canopy. See that? This canopy up here. Last year. Because I thought it'd be, well, it's helpful. It's helpful to block out some of the sun and the glare and stuff on the TV. And actually, I thought it would be good, you know, when it raining game that it'll help to drain the water and it does to a point but the problem is is when it gets a lot of rain a lot of rain on there it starts to puddle and, and droop so it's not a all day downpour and the thing is is you they have like a scale of how much rain or how much wind you can have and at some point the wind will take it off like a giant kite but for tonight while i do this that this will work. This will work because now I can be up here under the fire for a little bit and, and have a conversation with you guys. Now, it's been a long day. I got up at four o'clock this morning because I had to take care of Yolanda Flanders, um, getting her pieces of stuff out to her. And I'm glad we got, got them done. Well, one piece will go out tomorrow, but she got the first two. She'll get those tomorrow. And I'm happy to have that. I've got some more you all people that I apologize that I've been crazily busy in fact even though i got up at four this morning i'm gonna be working until at least 11 o'clock tonight because we are doing the piece uh the makeup piece for dak prescott with all the signature in fact we had four people that said hey since you're recutting can i get my name added onto it so we actually had a few more donations so we're going to be making a another donation to dak in his foundation and i think i i need to hurry up here because i think I think I'm getting a bit, bunch of water on here. You might see like all of a sudden a big whoosh, come down on here and I, I don't want to destroy this. So we're getting closer and closer to the draft. And let me say, wow, Bosch Lombardi. You know, I remember when we went down to the draft. This is when I met Bosch Lombardi the very first time um, in person. We did the draft in Dallas. We had the RV and stuff in there. And I knew Vosh had talent there because Vosh literally, it was so easy to work with him because as we're watching the draft and stuff, we drafted Van Der Esch and everything else. You could literally just say a name, just any name. And he could just like, boom, boom, just pop it right out there. And you knew every, he knew everything about that person. I could just be there and say, Leighton Van Der Esch, what do you know about him? Oh man, dude, here's a little bit of, it's like, man, I said, I called him the machine gun because he can just shoot that shit just out like that. So I'm really proud of him uh, working um, with Colin Cowherd and that whole new network and stuff. You know, definitely proud of him. But we do have the draft coming up in a little over three weeks. It's crazy. It's crazy. And so the Cowboys, let's be clear here. I know what you guys want. I know what you guys want. You guys want the sizzle. You want the sizzle, man. You, you, it's like the bacon, you know. You know, bacon's like it's shriveling up, but it's okay. You want the sizzle, which is the wide receiver. I know that. I I understand that. Everybody understands that. And you know, we've had so much talk about Cowboys. You know, maybe they should go after DJ Metcalf. You know, Devontae Smith out there. We got wide receivers coming in. 
everybody wants the wide receivers. I get that. That's the things, you know, you sell the jerseys. You know, it's like the Playmaker, 88. Everybody wants the 88. Everybody wants the C.D. Lamb. Everybody wants the Drew Pearson. I get that. Or you want the Zeke Elliott or the quarterback. But, guys, we need to focus in on the big nasties. The mean song bitches that don't talk much. The real substance here. The bottom line is, damn, bottom line is, it's raining like a mother humper out here. And of course, I left this out here and it got soaking wet. We have to focus in on the offensive line. There's no if, ands, or buts about it, okay? I'm not saying that Lyle Collins was, you know, the best offensive lineman in football or that um, Connor Williams wasn't, you know, what was as, as well. They were, they were decent. They were serviceable. And we don't have serviceable, decent guys right now for guard. We need real help. Real, and it's no if, ands, or buts about it. This is not one of those ones where we can just pass up on having offensive line. And also, I, I really need a defensive tackle. I need a one technique. I need a damn nose guard. I mean, straight up, big, nasty, mean mother humper. Okay? I think the Cowboys at least realize that as well. But the thing that's still bugging me is, as I think about our situation right now, wide receiver, where we're looking and saying that we may have to spend draft capital. And as I know that the Rams somehow were able to sign Bobby Wagner for $6 million, that I feel like the Cowboys were about the dumbest mother humpers out there, okay? See, Dad, I didn't say the F word. I didn't say the F word. That they should have held on to Cedric Wilson. If you at least had on, held on to Cedric Wilson with James Washington and C.D. Lamb, you could look at that and say, okay, we got guys that are familiar. Look at that. See? That's what I tell you. But at least, a good thing I'm not, I, if I was sitting right there, it'd be like somebody, that, that that's the Joneses. That's Jerry. Look at that. That's Jerry and Stephen Jones. They're pissing on our head right now. That's what, look, look. The Jones. Jerry's taking a leak. He's taking a hell of a leak. That's what's happening to us, guys. They are literally pissing on our head and telling us it's raining. But here out here, it is rain, it is raining out here. It's it's pouring out here right now. And I need to wrap this up because I don't know how much water is on this thing. And I don't want to find out. The shit I do for you guys. It's cold out here. It's raining. And I'm still trying to do a fireside chat. But make no mistake about it. We need offensive line. We want linemen. We want linemen. We want linemen. We want... Yo. It... It just blew the fire out. Damn. It rained so hard, the fire went out. Alright. With that being said... I'm getting in out of the rain. And I, I, I'm taking taking my cover with me. Wow. That mother... Hold on. It put out my fire. It's really raining out here. All right. We want linemen. 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 We want... Okay. You get the picture. I'm glad that this made it through the winter. <laughs> and now that it's getting close to spring... We're going to start setting up out here again. In fact, I think we'll do the draft out here. All right. I'll catch you later. Peace.